Hey everyone, Dimitri here, founder of Just Reach Out. Today I want to show you how to get the most value out of Just Reach Out. Welcome and let's jump in. There are four main search tools in Just Reach Out. Press opportunities, guest posting, journalists, and link love. We suggest you use them in that priority. So let's jump into press opportunities. And for our example, we're going to be using Crystal, which is a startup that does AI-powered um, chat, AI-powered AI advise, advisor that can get you a lot of different data. So say I'm the startup, I'm looking to get some quick press. Uh, the first thing that I do is I, I go and execute a press opportunity search. Why do I do press opportunities? I do press opportunities because these are journalists who are looking for an expert. So let's jump in and see. I typed in AI. Why did I type AI? Because that's part of what I do, right? I'm Crystal. I do this this uh, this AI, AI, AI powered chat. And so um, as you see, I typed in AI. There are nine results. That means that nine journalists right now are looking for an expert in AI. And that's Let's jump in and see what these journalists want. So we see Eric Martin is writing for Speed Technology Magazine. They need something by 21st of May, and he tells us everything he needs. He, he needs um, you know, he, AI research in advance, whatever it may be. He needs an expert to talk about this topic, right? So um, he has specific questions, and if you think you fit the bill, then all you do is you respond to this journal, to this email address from your email. We urge you and we ask you to do this every single day of the week. This might take five minutes, this might take 10 minutes, but this, at the end of the day, helps you a great deal. We'll, we'll show you, uh, and we link this up in the training, we'll show you in, in a bit, but there is a great, uh, use case of how uh, one of our customers is repeatedly getting press uh, by responding to these uh, requests and they even showed the actual template that they're using so here it is hey Nancy and remember the subject line is one of the main things here hey Nancy regarding us nicely and then there's the actual template so we'll link that up and um, again press opportunities is one of the simplest uh, searches to use and this is what you should be using as the first go-to thing. You don't need to do much. You look it up, you click on it, you check out if you qualify and then you respond using the template. The next search is guest posting and why do we want to jump to guest posting right from press opportunities? Well again this is the next level up to uh, being the easiest for you, right? Um, when you start talking to journalists, you need to pitch a story. You need to have a story that fits within their beat, right? When you're writing guest posts, you're writing for the publications. You're writing an op-ed or you're writing a, a, a something that you have experience about. Um, this a search allows you to input your industry. And, you know, in our study, uh, say we're, we're again, AI-powered uh, intelligence chat. So, you know, it might be science, for example. Science might be a good one. What you see here is the domain rating. This is the domain rating of all the different blogs um, that you're seeing on the left. So it goes from 0 to 100. Check the, these blogs out by visiting the website and seeing the types of articles they have published recently and see if that fits with some of the topics that you are an expert in. You can, of course, click Send Email Pitch. And that's where you'll be able to send your pitch into that uh, publication. Now, you would have to write something or write a draft to send to them. And so this is the place where you can jump around and, and see if, uh, you know, different types of publications might be a better fit for you. And you can see how popular it is by seeing this number between 0 and 100. Now, the least popular ones come up first because that's the easiest ones to get in and uh, submit something to get the ball rolling. So again, this is in priority two for you. So after you do your press opportunity search, please do guest posting after that. The, la the next search, number three, is journalists. And for that, you can see that we put in conversational AI for that. Now, when you put in conversational AI, we see 197 results. You can trigger the date by, by pushing it back. Say it's March, say it's February. That's where you can see 
more and more results. Now, um, there will be other filters that pop up here based on the search that you put in that allow you to control the results and filter in and target very specific things. But in here, you can start reading the actual headlines and figuring out if this is somebody you want to talk to. And if it is, you'll click that favorite button. You'll click that favorite button. Um, once you start researching this, and you can actually click and check out the, uh, the actual article by clicking on the title, you might see something like this. Microsoft reveals the future of Cortana, personal assistant. So you're just saying, oh, okay, so I, I'm a convers conversational AI chat, but Cortana seems to be in my space. Maybe I should do a, spa a search on Cortana and see who's covering Cortana. It would be much more topical, right? When you're ready to pitch, you can, of course, click send email pitch and pick the best template uh, that's pre-filled for you already from the best performing templates in our tool set and send that email out. You'll be able to track and we'll jump into that um, in another training. But um, I strongly suggest that you target people and do the research and take the time to really think through how you would start that conversation with, say, Julian, right? How would you start talking to them?